Good afternoon and welcome to Exploring Our Quad Cities. Every month on the second Tuesday, we're highlighting an event coming up in the Quad Cities while also exploring the communities in the region where those big events are happening. Today, you might be able to tell behind me, we are live along the Mississippi River in Moline at the Bass Street YMCA branch, which is home to the Y Quad Cities rowing team in the rowing program here. And rowing practice, that's actually going on right now. We have a couple different teams out. You might see them going by occasionally here behind me. We're going to speak with them a little bit later and hear all about the wonderful rowing program here at the Y in the Quad Cities in a little bit. And we'll also talk with some folks from River Action. So we have that to look forward to over the next 30 minutes also. First though, we are going to take a ride on the Celebration Bell. Doing a little celebrating, celebrating of its own this year as they celebrate 39 years cruising on the river. We're learning all about that paddle wheel that we see so often going up and down the Mississippi River from the captain himself and Local 4's Brandy Otterson. We are coming to you from the wheelhouse of the Celebration Bell, and here with me today is Captain Jeremy Kern. Jeremy, thanks so much for having us on board today. Absolutely. Good afternoon. So tell me a little bit about yourself and your history with the water. My history with the water. Well, I've been around the water my whole entire life since I've been about eight years old. Commercially, I've been uh, piloting and working the Mississippi River and other waters uh, for about 26 years. Um, and that's, that's pretty much a lot of my history. I've uh, captained uh, many other passenger boats, some bigger than this, some smaller than this. Um, and I also worked for towboat company for 20 years. And, uh, retired from there and went back to the passenger boats. Yeah, you have a long history then. So when did you actually start manning this boat? And, and what's your favorite part as well? Oh, so this boat here was about two years ago. So this is my second season okay. uh, that I've been with the company. Uh, my favorite part is uh, meeting and greeting all kinds of different people. That would be my favorite part. Yeah, and there's you see people all day long, uh, right. nonstop, right? Nonstop. <laughs> So can you tell us a little bit more about the Celebration Bell and its history? The Celebration Bell company has been in business for about 39 years. Um, so this boat was acquired in 2008. Um, they had bought it from uh, another company and uh, retrofitted it back into an excursion boat. Uh, the boat itself is about 200 foot long. It's 46 feet wide and four decks tall. Um, and uh, they do regular cruises here in the between lock 15 and lock 14 and then we also do trips out of town about once a month okay and you say that you grew up on the water what's so special though about the mississippi river um, my parents have always lived around the water whether it had been down in florida or massachusetts or back into the midwest here along the mississippi river so um, it's just a part of my childhood that i like to keep reliving and sharing with my children so yeah, for sure. So why should someone experience a cruise here on Celebration Bell? Well, not only do you uh, have a good time and taking a, a trip that you don't have to worry about but showing up, but you also get to see all the wildlife and the historic sites from the river. Um, it's also just a nice way to relax and have a glass of tea or lemonade. <laughs> yeah, and you guys have uh, great dinner options too. Great food to choose from. Absolutely. Yep, there's there's great options. So for our dinner cruise, they uh, they have a prime rib and a chicken and uh, all the other sides like vegetables and potatoes. Yeah. You bet. And you say, you know, you're on the river all day long. You get to see everything up close and personal here on the river. You actually got to see the bit the bridge being built as well, right? Yep, we sure did. We got to see every stage of the bridge. The neatest part of the bridge is when they built coffer dams to put the footings in for the bridge, you could actually see to the bottom of the river, to the river bed. And uh, just along the whole process with all the crane and the heavy lifting of different sections of the bridge, it was a pretty neat experience to be able to witness. That would, that would be really cool though. So cool to see, up close and personal. Jeremy, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us. You're a busy man, we're gonna let you get back to work. All right, thank you. All right, now the Celebration Bell, it has a, a very busy cruising schedule. There are lunch and dinner cruises to choose from, plus several other additional options, and we're gonna hear all about that and the other events they have going on a little bit later in the show. All right, thank you, Brandy. Looking forward to that. You know, I think it's been a couple of years since I've been on the Celebration Bell. Looking forward to getting back out on that big boat on the river here as soon as possible. 